This is AIR. Artists in Residence Broadcasting. Coming to you once a week from New York City. Hello, I'm John Cullum, and this is my wife, Emily Frankel. Cooking up a subject. Yeah, oh, well, well, you're a good cook. That's I am a, cooking up a subject. All right, what is the subject? I idea? want to what? tell people mm -hmm. about arguments. Uh, arguments? Do we ever have arguments? Aren't we an ideal couple? Don't we get along beautifully? We always love each other. We're so sweet together. Do we ever argue? No, but we don't all we don't often agree. <laughs> well, we do argue. Yes, of course we do. Talk about arguments. What do we argue about? Do we argue about money? Not no. usually. No, we don't usually walk, argue about money. Uh, do we? I'm a and I'm a cheapskate, and you're you're and you're a, a not spend a spendthrift. I can be a spendthrift. But you can you don't mind spending money, and you never have, even when you didn't. I have don't it. spend money on clothes, but. If I'm buying things and I'm not sure, I might buy two so that I have a chance to see what I've got and I might keep both things. Can I tell the audience how much you paid for your first, what was the Exxon, uh, what was that called? Oh, my Exxon t um, automatic typewriter. Yes. We paid ten thousand dollars for that. That was just start I was starting out as a writer, and I wanted a good tool. That's right. So I got a ten thousand dollar tool. And then I and then I, I traded it in. No, wait a minute. <laughs> we, we bought we bought an advanced uh, Exxon thing, but it was second hand, and it was much more powerful than the first one, the ten thousand dollars. And we paid four thousand dollars for that. Right. And then and we then, bought two more of those. Well, oh, we, oh, I. What happened was that, that within get six to years. Well, this is an argument, but okay. within six six years, they had become obsolescent. We couldn't get anybody Exxon re wash their hands of it, and I remember I had to. I couldn't get rid of them. I tried. I called museums. I called. Uh, I called uh, schools. I called everybody to try to give them away, and I ended up. Tearing them down piece by piece because they were enormous, and leaving them on the street in the in the trash cans. I'd have been. <laughs> we had Exxon computer stuff spread out all over the Gramercy. <laughs> all over New York. Yes. Talk about arguments. Arguments. Well. What do we argue about? Well. Do we argue about what we like in art? The truth is, we argue about everything. We do. Everything that comes up, we we don't agree on it, and we fully. have to kind and, of and we mesh and sort of discuss it. And and the fact is, John is nicer than I am. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> I won't argue with you on that. Wait a minute, <laughs> I'm nicer than you. Well, I, we we I can. I'm get very into, sweet. I will argue with that. I'm <laughs> kind. <laughs> yes, you are. Yes, you are. You are all of those things on so Monday, you... Wednesday, and Friday. <laughs> on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturday, you are a harridan. Is that a good word? A harridan is a very good word. Yeah. Do we argue then a lot? Is it a discussion? Is it that we don't agree that we have to kind of iron out where That's we stand on things? Absolutely. Not only that, we we constantly uh, we constantly are trying to find out from the other persons more information about every subject that we deal with. And so it, 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 you could say it sounds like an argument, but what we're doing is we're examining everything that we do uh, uh, under a, a, a microscope and under the other person's... Uh, but John drives me nuts when he meticulously, meticulously, meticulously... That's a wonderful word, meticulous. Huh? Going into... <laughs> <laughs> Unnecessary details, whereas I, mile a minute, need information so that I can make a decision. And if I make the wrong decision, I go with it. And we do argue about that. We yes. argue about John being meticulous and me saying, No, I'm gonna I wanna go I wanna do that. And he says, No, it doesn't make sense. Stop. And then we argue. Well, Jack Spratt could eat no fat, his wife could eat no lean. So between the both, you see, they licked the platter clean. Okay. So we, 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 Emily 
does things her way and I try to do things my way. I don't succeed a great deal because Emily is too fast for me. And uh, Emily get, argues him out of it. That's right. Okay, so I just wanted you to know, ladies and gentlemen who are watching. <laughs> that Emily argues me out of our arguments. <laughs> that's the truth. Now, that's oh, the truth. Okay, so we've answered that question. We've told you that we are a happy couple that's who right. argue. argue. That's right. Absolutely. So, this is the end of this video. See you next week. This is AIR. See you next week.